Hi, I'm Kristen Burt for Red Carpet Report. Tonight we're at the Ace Eddie Awards honoring the best in editing for 2016. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> How many times a day do people come up to you and say, you're oh, welcome? Yeah, that's the running joke. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, and you have to sing it. You have to hit that right pitch. So uh, yeah. I don't hit the right pitch, but I no, will I sing. I don't either. I don't either, but <laughs> everyone does it. Yeah. Talk about the reception to this film. I went to see it over the Thanksgiving holiday with a huge array of kids, all ages. We had so much fun. It, it is. It's been so well received. And I think there's something magical about a Disney animated film that's also a musical People just love these things, and you know they, they, they sing the songs, they love the characters, and they can go back and watch it over and over again. I think that might be a testament to the, the musical aspect of it. So I'm just very thrilled to have been a part of this film. And you have The Rock, and I tell you, he is the best ambassador for yes. any film. Oh, absolutely. Uh, it's interesting. Uh, we recorded with Dwayne like eight or nine times, and I was able to work with him directly. And he is the nicest guy in the world. And I mean, he's also the busiest guy in Hollywood, yet when he was with us, he gave us 150%. And he would do whatever, however many takes we needed, whatever performance we were trying to get, he just gave his all for this role. And it really shows. I love to hear that, especially celebrities that are reached that A-list status. Oh, I know, I know, and it was tough because it was hard to get him. It's like we'd always try to schedule to bring him to California for recordings. Not Dwayne. It's like we had to go to New York, we had to go to Florida, we had to go to Atlanta. It's like he's the hardest guy to track down. But when we got a hold of him, he was he was with us 100%, so it was great. He's very present. That's amazing. Yes. How about for animation? What are the biggest challenges when editing animation compared to a 30-minute you know, sitcom? You know, the biggest challenge is that these movies take three years to make. So the biggest challenge is maintaining your interest and your enthusiasm in the project starting from the very beginning. I, I personally find it very easy because the movie we started making three years ago is very different from the movie we ended up with. So it does go through so many iterations that kind of helps keep your interest level. And then as the story tar starts to come together, you start getting in animation and effects and you get music and you get the songs from Lin-Manuel Miranda and everything just gets elevated. And so every week it's something new and I think that helps to keep it fresh and exciting. So that, but that's the biggest challenge is just maintaining that enthusiasm for so long. And then you get things like Oscar nominations, so that's certainly yes, not bad. Yeah. This time of year, it's wonderful. Everything that's coming out, we're getting all these nominations, and it's, just, it's such an honor to be nominated for this. Congratulations. Thanks it's so such a fun film to watch, oh, and I know you. all your hard work went into it for years. Yes, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, like this video, and in the comments below, let us know what your favorite movie of 2016 was.